How's it going, everyone? Session here. Welcome back to Tales of Arise. We continue exactly right where we left off. I do need to reminisce over something, though, because I was... Anyways, let's just... Zephyr, why aren't you concerned about who I am? You feeling left out, son? No, it's not that. But... You said you wanted to fight so that you can live a free man. At this point, that's all that matters. Even if it somehow turned out you were a Renan, it wouldn't be such a big deal. A Renan? Until we know who you are, we can't rule anything out. Besides, we've already got Shion with us. At this point, what's one more Renan as long as they're on our side? So you don't see every Renan as an enemy? Our goal isn't to hunt down and kill all Renans. We only arm ourselves as much as we need to, to set ourselves free. If you can believe it, not every Danon agrees with what we're doing either. Are you saying we have enemies among the Danons? Uh, not quite. They're just not up for rebelling, per se. The thing you have to remember is that everyone has their own path to walk. I'm not sure I understand. That's okay. Just focus on what we have to do right now. However, the time will come when you'll need to decide what to do for yourself. Mm. How come you don't have a scar on your hand? A scar? What do you mean? The Crimson Crows all tore off their own spirit course, right? But your hand doesn't show any signs of ever having a core like theirs. Why not? I... don't know. I don't remember anything about myself from before Doc found me. Seriously? You have that mask, you don't feel any pain, and you just happen to know how to fight with a sword? No way. You must remember something. I'm not lying, if that's what you think. Believe me, I wish I knew who the hell I am. But I don't. It's funny how I didn't have any time for soul-searching while digging up rocks in a mine. Still. Are you saying you've told us everything about yourself? Zephyr. It's bad manners to pry when you've got plenty to hide yourself. <laughs> You're not gonna ask me about my past, too? Only when I think it's necessary. You're a real man of mystery, I'll admit. That said, I'm not one to dig around in someone's business just out of curiosity. If you remember something and feel like sharing, you're free to do so. For now, I think that's good enough. Right. Thank you. All right. Ooh. So this whole you not feeling pain thing, is that for real? Why would I lie about it? And why would you care anyway? No, it's just, you know, I can't imagine what it's like, that's all. As a slave, I'd say it has its advantages and disadvantages. Oh? On the upside, when Renan soldiers push me around, I hardly flinch. The downside's that I get injured without even noticing. Which means I could be knocking on death's door and not even realize it. Really? Sure. I may be numb to pain, but that doesn't make me immortal or anything. Still, I wouldn't have noticed any of this if someone hadn't pointed it out to me. If not for my fellow slaves, I'd be long dead, lying in a ditch somewhere. Hmm, okay. And with that, it's time to go to rest. A Master Corps, huh? Now I see. So that's why Balsef's cronies were so desperate to catch her. Is that what it's called? The jewel in her chest? Oh, right. You don't remember a damn thing, do you? Ah, fair enough. I guess it's time to fill you back in. Tell me, you ever wonder why we Danans are made to work ourselves to the bone, day in, day out? Well, when you put it like that, I always just assumed we were mining resources for them. Then don't you think it'd be quicker if they used all that high-powered tech they have? Why go to all the trouble of relying on weak human labor? Listen, what the Renans are really after isn't resources or minerals. It's astral energy.
They're harvesting the astral energy that sleeps inside all matter in life forms. And they're doing it the same way they have for the past 300 years, using us Danans as mere siphons. Oh. Right. They have machines for minerals, but extracting from Danans requires spirit cores. Any astral energy collected passes through a spirit vessel on its way to being stored in a master core. But why go to the trouble of collecting all this energy in the first place? Do they really need all that juice just to use astral arts? It determines the Sovereign. Sovereign? Is that the Renan ruler? Exactly. Five lords, each doing whatever it takes to gather as much astral energy as they can and store it in their master cores. Whichever of them manages to accumulate the most power at the end of their contest is crowned the ruler of the Renan Motherland. A new crown contest, as they call it, is held every decade or so. So you see, the master cores are the receptacles in which the lords store their power, and we Danans are sacrificed so the Renans can choose their new ruler. That's insane! You're telling me that's what our people have been dying for this whole time? Relax, hero. You're not the only one who's bent out of shape about the whole thing. There are two things that I haven't been able to get my head around yet. What business would a Renan have stealing a Master Corps? And what's the deal with that blazing sword? I think the sword is a physical manifestation of the Master Corps' astral energy. As for why it took the shape of a sword, well, I don't know any more than you do. Honest. And that stuff about needing your permission to use it? What was that about? I'm the only one of us who can control the Master Core to some extent. Without me to adjust the flow of astral energy, the sword can't take a physical form. What do you want out of this? You may be one of them, but you don't strike me as the ruthless oppressor type. I'm going to take down all of the Lords. Never thought I'd say this, but I like the cut of your jib, Renan. <laughs> Very well. As far as we're concerned, the struggle continues either way. And with that sword on our side, our chances of victory just increased. That is, of course, assuming we can count the two of you in. Fine by me. After all, it sounds like we're after the same thing anyway. I... Honestly, I'm still a little confused by all this. But if it's a choice between this or going back to being a slave, then I choose to fight. Then it's settled. Together, we'll overthrow the Renan Lords. And first up on that chopping block is Balsef, the wild beast. Sound good? Hmm. What was that? I've got to hurry. We have another. Ooh, I see directions where you can check your main. Oh, okay. Secret hideout in Ulzebek, not far from here. We should be able to meet up with our comrades there. Okay. We go to the north. Should be able to eat this. Whenever you find some, make sure to grab it. It's edible, huh? Hmm. Good to know. Definitely. Oh, there's more stuff in there too. I didn't think that you could do that. Cut it out. 
Didn't anyone ever tell you it's rude to stare? I know I already asked you this, but are you sure we haven't met somewhere before? <sighs> What's so hard to understand? I'm Renan, you're Danon. There's no way. Besides, I'm from Lenigus. Trust me, wherever you were before you lost your memory, we've never crossed paths. Lenigus? You mean the same Lenigus that's up in the sky? I've heard it called the Renan's Castle, but I never imagined people actually lived up there. Well then, where did you think we all lived? Didn't you see the Renan Lords descend for the crown contest? And how long ago was that? Well, the current contest started seven years ago, so... Then I wouldn't remember. Just how far back do you remember? About a year, give or take. That's how long ago Doc found me. One year. Then no. I'm sorry, but there really is no way we could have met. Guess not. Hmm. Hey. Noise. What's nice. this nice? One enormous stray. I don't think we can take it right now. Ooh. I could fight them and potentially win or suffer. Hmm. We've almost made it to Ulzebek. Do I dare try? I do want to navigate this area around a bit. It seems like there's a lot of really good stuff around here. Normally, I don't pick on the weak. Here I come. Swallow blade. This is it. Dig oh, deep. Easier You're said than done. No, oh my gosh! Hold on. Here, let me help. I'm like getting destroyed. Thank you. I almost just like got I removed. Feel my power okay, well, got lucky and a half. Thanks, Shion. What's this thing? Okay. Okay. And and I thought to myself, I wanted to fight the big guy at the top. I think I'll pass. I'll take you all on. Take it. You're I'll run you through. Here Don't go charging off like that. Swallow blade. Cannon. You're mine. Take it. I'm only getting started. You're finished. Rising I'm on it. That is coming. It's over. Go. Oh. Hmm. Pathetic. Woohoo. Dogtail. Oh. Woohoo. I think it gave me a cosmetic just now. Hi, That's friend. Usual bird. It's an owl. They're often used as a symbol to represent ancient Dana. Oh, okay. Yeah, they they drop off like bonus stuff. Okay, I got like a cosmetic out of that. That was cool. Right here goes. Take it. I'm only getting started. You take this. Right. Rising wyvern. I'm not done. Mirage. It's over. Take this. I'm only getting started. Here I come. Started. You're finished. Rising wyvern. Here I come. Hmm. Let me know if you're struggling. Parallax stone. Okay.
Okay, people. This is it. Ulza back. No sign of any Renan guardsmen. The Renans aren't as populous as the Danans. Probably figure stationing guards in a place like this would be a waste of precious manpower. So this is where the next safe house is? Yes. The last place they'd think to look for enemies is on their own doorstep. That is, assuming anyone actually made it here before us. Zephyr! Oh. Looks like we needn't have worried. Come on. Wait, can I just... Ooh. How do I get shiny? Don't know. Okay, I just deal. Hmm. Ooh, it takes it back outside, I guess. Okay. I'm glad you're okay. Quick, get inside. Ah. Zephyr, you made it! See? I told you there's no way Zephyr would have kicked the bucket. Fine, you were right. So, what's the plan? Well, we've got an ace up our sleeve and the enemy's in disarray. I say we strike while the iron's hot. So we're finally going head to head with Balsef. That's right. We can't afford to mess this up. It's now or never. Then now it is. We've all been waiting for this day for far too long. Leave the plan to me. In the meantime, yeah, you two need to do something about your outfits. I have just the thing for your size. Stay right there, okay? Sounds good. Ta-da! I told you, it fits like a dream. Hmm. I'm afraid we don't have any Renan clothing. I could find you some Danon outfits. But something tells me you'd rather pass. Is this really that important? In case you need reminding, I'm here because our interests overlapped. Nothing more. At no point did I say I've given up being a Renan. Now, now, let's play nice. How about you ask Nate and see what he says? He's our one-stop shop for info around here. With any luck, he might just know something. Ooh, Tilsa W. Okay. Oh, where are the Thenopes? <sighs> Try to be careful not to stand out too much. You're the only Renan around here, you know. I know. I was just thinking about how communal it feels here. Even though it's only supposed to be slave quarters. Huh? Oh, yeah. When you put it like that, I guess it is different from heavily patrolled Mosgul. Were you expecting something more depressing? It's likely a sign that Balsef doesn't think you guys can do anything to him. What? I mean, if Balsef thought the Crimson Crows actually posed a threat to him, he'd figure he'd be trying harder to suppress them. You... Uh, uh, no. You're probably right about that. All of the other Danans that aren't with the Crimson Crows accept the Renan's rule as simply a fact of life. From the day we're born, no, probably even before that, it's been drilled into us that the only purpose our lives have is to help select the next sovereign. If they don't like the status quo, then they should fight it. Otherwise, they're endorsing it either way. 
I see it differently, but that's just me. Speaking of Renans, do all of them think about things the way you do? I won't deny that among my fellow Renans, power and status are everything. However, that isn't what this is about for me. I have something I need to do. And I'll do whatever it takes, and use whoever and whatever I need in order to get the job done. To hell with power. Respect. Nath, we need your help. Ah, oh, damn. Never the manpower when you... Huh? Help, huh? What kind? Is it urgent? Well, no, not exactly. Well, in that case, would you mind helping me out with something first? The work's really piled up around here. What is it you'd like us to do? Anything you can manage. No one cares about us slaves. That's why it's all the more important that we stick together and take care of each other. Check in with that guy over there for details on what needs doing. And thanks in advance. Sure thing. I wonder if something happened. Hey. No, he sent us. He heard you might be a little short-handed. Yes! You could say that. Didn't think he'd send over the Iron Mask himself, though. Thought of bright eyes with you. You sure we can really trust her? <sighs> She's on our side. Zephyr can vouch for her. Hmm. If Zephyr's good with her, then I guess we don't have a problem. Eh, yeah, what the hell. The name's Dyron. I'm the one who runs this lodge. Hmm? This is a lodge? But we already have our own beds. <laughs> we don't sleep on straw and rock hard dirt around here. The Crimson Crows have their fair share of folks who are either knocking on death's door or can't otherwise move around openly. That's what this place is here for. To give people a place to rest up properly before they head off to fight. Everybody needs their rest. If you don't rest, you can't hope to fight the bright eyes at your best. I guess. Makes sense. What do you want us to do then? I need you to help haul in some cargo. I have some friends who are on the way to collect it from our hideout in the Zion mine. The mines? Is that really such a good place? A good idea after the Renan's snuck the place out? These are valuable items people risk their lives to gather. We need to get at least some of them back. They should be down around the San Dinis Ravine at this point. Meet up with them and help bring the supplies back to the lodge. Got it. You're welcome to use these facilities if you need to as well. I'll let you sleep here for free. Noise. Subquests. Gotcha. Cool, cool. I had no idea the Crimson Crows were so active. You sound pretty thrilled by that. Thrilled? Maybe. But I'll settle for hopeful. We know now that not everyone is rolling over for the Renans. So we gotta go find that. And if I'm aware, we gotta go back south. Okay. We'll be back. Now the problem is that Zephyr is not with us. Out of curiosity, is there any way to check my... No. Okay. I'll take my levels and that kind of thing. Get 
Hmm. Barely a blip on our radar. I'm thinking about it. I might give it a try. He's already dead. Damn them! They've killed so many of us, and it's still not enough! They won't be satisfied until they've wiped us all out like pests! <sighs> he mentioned something about those bushes. We should check them. Is this... a cooking pot? But what is it doing here? If I had to guess, he put it there to make sure a Renan wouldn't steal it. <sighs> so even though he knew he was dying, he chose to use the last of his strength to hide it, believing somebody <sighs> would come for it. I guess you think it's stupid getting killed over a silly trinket, huh? No. Clearly, he risked his life for something he believed in. I would never mock someone for that. However, it will be up to us to figure out the purpose behind his dying act. We'll make sure it wasn't in vain. If nothing else, this proves that the Renans can be outsmarted. We'll carry out your will, and see it through to the end. Then we'd better get going. We don't know when those soldiers might be back to make another sweep of the area. So this is what it means to fight the Renis. Sounds like you're kind of scared to me. Of course I am. But if I'm gonna die one way or another, I'd rather go down fighting. Hmm. We're so high up. That wasn't like that before, was it? It wasn't. What is that? Because we came down here before last time. There. Oh, it's the same thing from before. Okay. I kind of figured as much. Back up we go. I feel almost inclined. Okay, is it possible to save? Okay, good. I'm gonna give it a try. We'll find out how this works out for us. I'd steer clear of that Zoogle if I were you. Damn, that weak, huh? Level 43? Well, we tried. <laughs> we sure tried. If you gave me like an idea numerically what the level was, I would have respected it. But you didn't, so I had to find out. It wasn't worth it. I think I did two damage to it, and it had 219,000 health. All right. Damn, so nobody made it, huh? I'm sorry. 
If we'd have brought just a little sooner, we could have... Hey, these things happen. It hurts, but this is the world we live in. I'll take good care of what you brought back. It's the only way we can respect the sacrifice of those we've lost. Uh? Hey, when's Daddy coming home? Oh no, that's the guy's kid. Hmm. Not yet, sweetie. Your dad's gone away for a while, and... Don't. Don't lie to me. He's dead, isn't he? <laughs> I know that whenever grown-ups look sad and I say someone's gone, they always mean they're dead. Daddy always warned me that this might happen one day. He told me to stay strong and be brave. So I... <laughs> this isn't right. Poor kids shouldn't have to be dragged into our own mess. Let's report, report back to Nathan's, then get ready to fight. Man... Ooh. Oh, there's a okay. As you fulfill certain properties to your characters, you earn titles. Unlock arts and skills. Ooh. Okay. Skill points that are uh-huh. If there's a skill you want to learn, but just have the SP for it, yeah. Highlight it with the impress Ah, uh, Okay. Oh, that's cool. I like that actually. Oh, so I currently have 250. Ooh, be right back. Okay. All right, it's gonna get pretty advanced with that. So we'll see. I Ooh. feel like somebody's watching us. Maybe there's someone around here who needs our help. I think I know what you're talking about. I'm skeptical. You must have gone through the San Dennis Ravine to get here, right? Is that Zugal still out there? Big guy? Looks like an insect with wings, has sight for arms. Right. Yeah, we saw it. We also died by it for a brief second, but it looked pretty big and tough to boot. Mm -mm. That's the one. It's hard to feel safe knowing it's still out there. I'd really like to see it get its comeuppance one of these days. Especially since the people that deliver that comeuppance are going to enjoy a pretty mighty payday on account of all the material they'll earn. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah? Yep, Zugal materials are imbued with astral energy, so the stronger they are, the more energy their materials contain. We could use them to make new weapons and stand up to the Rena a little better, even with our astral art handicap. With the odd stray, I can usually gather a few people and get the materials myself. Hmm. But something that big's bound to be beyond my capabilities, if only there was a good way to beat it. All right. I don't see the harm in checking it out. <sighs> Did you hear what you're saying? We've got enough to worry about, as it is without inviting even more danger. Yeah, Renan Pal's right. I know you're strong, but I think even this Zugal might be beyond you. It's not like I need you guys to take it out for us right away, but how should I put it? If anybody has a shot at it, I think it'll still be you guys eventually. Once you feel like you're up to the challenge, that is. When you are, would you be willing to give it a shot? You can bring other people along with you to help, of course. Got it. Sure, that sounds fair. We'll get it taken care of for you sooner or later. I learned my lesson. We'll get it later. You're back, huh? Sounds like it was a real ordeal out there. Much as I hate to admit it, there aren't many of us who can take on those Renan armored soldiers. All we can do is make sure we remember those who sacrificed their lives for the cause. Yeah. They won't be forgotten. Glad to hear it. Now, what was that favor you wanted to ask me? Oh, right. Well, you see... So then, you're wondering if I know of any places where you can find Brennan equipment, huh? Anywhere with those damn bright eyes is gonna have tight security, of course. You can't just go carelessly poking around. Unless... Across the wilderness, outside Ulzebek, you'll find the Fagan Ruins. There's some kind of old Renan castle out there. What with it being impenetrable, I forgot. But with a Renan tagging along, who knows? Maybe you can find some way in. You ask me, though, it's a lot of trouble for some Renan rags. If I were you, I'd get comfortable with Danon garbs. Those look like the ruins. Let's move. Are we really going in there? Yes. Now let's move. 
Well, she may like Danon, but she is a Renan. Hey, Shion, where does your gun come from? What do you mean, where does it come from? When you're fighting, it looks like it just appears out of nowhere. Oh, that's transferal technology. When I don't need my weapon, I submerge it in empty space. And when I do, I summon it. Make sense? Not really, but it sounds pretty amazing. Huh? Well, that way you don't have to carry around any heavy weapons or worry about enemies trying to steal them, right? It's a pretty cool invention. You realize you're praising the technology of your enemies, right? So? Technology is technology. It's not good or bad in and of itself. I guess that's true. Hey, yeah. Am I really doing this for some lousy cloak? <gasps> there are Sugals here too? Hey! You should always assume there's Zoogles anywhere you go. They're one of the reasons I need you all. We're a team after all, and that means you need to pull your weight. So when I call for you, I expect you to clear out any enemies around me. What? What do I have to do all the in exchange? When you call for me, I promise I'll shoot down any enemies around you too. Sound fair? Right. Yeah. All right. If you don't get in the habit of speaking up during fights, that'll impact morale and our ability to combo together. So make sure to do it often. Just Got a it? Minute. Unless the enemy spotted us, time to get to work. You don't have to tell me that. Can summon allies in combat to boost their unique boost attack. Once the boost gauge is full, press in the corresponding direction to execute. Iron Blade, this is a brute force swing attack that can almost down any enemy. Or down almost any enemy. You can get mm. Tutorial? With that blade and your strength, the average Zoogle shouldn't be a problem, right? Ooh. I'll give it a shot. Here I come. Here I go. It's, it's over. Ah, eat dirt. Swallow blade. Slash. Don't Swallow find blade. someone else to pick up. Wing clip fires numerous beams of light from the muzzle of Shion's rifle. If it's on aerial enemies. Flyer. This one's mine. I'll shoot them down. Where are you going? Ooh. Hey. Teaming up with the farmers was the next thing to do. I see. This one's all mine. And again. Eat dirt. Swallow blade. Go. You're mine. It's over. This one's all mine. Take it. Go. 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 Where are you going? It's over. Slash. Rising right. wyvern. It's over. Your mother. Who wants to Slash. die next? Swallow blade. Take this. Hear me. It's over. Fury. Rising wyvern. Where are you going? Struck. Slash. Rising right. wyvern. Eat dirt. Hmm. I can also use it in air. Looks like you got the hang of it, but don't let it go to your head. Those were easy ones. True. Ugh. I know, I know. <sighs> I already did. Looks like it could be worth something. Ugh. You can hardly see anything from here. Why don't we climb up higher and see if we can get a better view? What's this thing? Whoa. I feel like that's what they're talking about. Oops. Hmm. So I'm guessing that's where we gotta go. 
That's kind of a big place to go to. What's up, guys? Out of our way. Take this. Got I'll take you all off. Behind you, Shion. Okay. Ooh. Those were a lot of wasps. I wanted that third one. No choice. Here I come. It's rest. over. So I'll concentrated in the middle of all these battles, it doesn't matter what we're going up against. We're having way too much fun out here. That's so cool, man. Okay. Well then, let's keep moving. I love the combo system in this game. That's really cool. Oh yeah, wait, I learned like a new art apparently, yeah? Ooh, ah, the demon fang. Alright. Okay, hold on. I'm kind of cooking now. That's the big dude. No choice. Here I come. Demon four. Rising wyvern. Mirage. Mega red. You're mine. It's over. Rising wyvern. I'm not done. Mirage. You're mine. Oh. Missed opportunity. Okay. I understand now. I understand now. Okay. I can feel my power growing. Ooh. Wait, can I uh Okay, cool. I have to just make sure I can like be max HP. I don't know if I should be afraid of you. Uh, I'm afraid. If we 
I love how I like backflipped away and then she burning striked it and it was that was fire. Alright. An opponent like this should be easy. I like that she continued the combo for my cancel off the off the oh man game is game is cracked <gasps> I didn't all right Oh, I don't have the... I actually knew about this. <gasps> Sheon! dramatic yeah right okay wait so then is she like oh okay well well we brought her back up to speed so she's doing better now oh I, I wonder if those are the Fagan ruins below us shouldn't be too much farther now if that's the I guess it's been a while since I had a bite to eat. Don't worry about me. I'm used to working while I'm hungry. It's no big deal. It is a big deal. You should eat whenever you can. The last thing I need is you keeling over in the middle of a fight just because you didn't eat. Never thought I'd get lectured on eating by a Renan, of all people. Yeah, well, some of us Renans know what it's like to go without food, believe it or not. What do you mean? I thought... This isn't about me. Now, are you going to eat or not? I would, if we had anything to eat. But we don't. <sighs> Actually, I have a little bit of food on me. You've been carrying that stuff around this whole time? Not sure it's going to be enough for the both of us, though. That's why we're going to cook it instead. Cook? I've never done anything like that before. Me neither, to be honest. But we've got to make something out of all this, so might as well try. Hmm. Usually there is one that is a chef, but it sounds like neither of us are. Okay. What are you staring at me for? Your clothes are all about function over form. You should think about sprucing them up a little. Why? What purpose would it serve? I guess you're right. I just think you'd look good with a little blue thrown in somewhere. Hmm. All right. I'll think about it. She's not wrong. 
Oh, at camps and inns, you can cook meals, confirm temporary for eating. You just can be made by writing recipes. Mm hmm. Depending on who's in the party cooks a meal, the effects and duration will vary. Oh, oh, you got a rotation duty? It? Ooh, okay, okay. All right, let's see. I think the only thing we can make is a porridge. So, defense up. You can consume double the ingredients for 90% to cooking effect and duration. Oh, okay. Oh, so it lasts 10 minutes, but if you double it, you can make it last 20? Okay. Okay. All done. Come and eat. Ah, so instead it lasts 19 minutes. Okay. I mean, I got deep up too. You really do eat through that mask of yours, huh? I'm impressed you can manage so well. Huh? Oh, it's nothing. You get used to it after a while. Still, I'm glad we decided to stop and fill our stomachs. I've got a newfound respect for cooking now. But I guess that's easy when you're used to eating everything raw. It would have been perfect if it had any flavor. Sorry it didn't live up to your palate. Oh, no, that wasn't a knock on you. I was just... Sorry, that's not how I should thank you for cooking for me. You've got me curious now. Is it just pain you can't sense, or are your taste buds shot too? Oh, sure, my taste buds work fine. Although, apparently what I like tends to be a little out there. How so? What's so unusual about what you eat? Well, one time I couldn't get enough of these things I picked off a plant, but everyone else said they were way too spicy. Doc thinks maybe I crave spicy food to compensate for the lack of pain I feel. Hmm. Maybe it's best I take charge of the cooking. You know, just to be on the safe side. I can't guarantee it'll be to your tastes, though. I said I'm sorry. Look, I'll learn to tone down my tastes in the future, so let's just put that slip of the tongue behind us already. <laughs> All right, my poor iron likes spicy food. I feel like she has a bit of a sweet tooth, but... Oh. Okay. However, we don't really have a lot of points, though. Oh, but she does have new stuff. Toxicity. Oh. oh, she's got some stuff, actually. Okay. Well, off we go. Well then, this is futuristic ish. Hmm. This must be it. Looks pretty ancient, but I recognize Renan architecture when I see it. Ancient, though. It's seen some beatings. If it stayed sealed all this time, it's not because people left it alone. It's not just their technology. The Renans build their structures out of special materials, too. Strong enough to withstand assaults from Danon tools and weaponry, anyway. So, how the hell are we? Easy. <sighs> Phew. <laughs> that may not have been a fancy feast we just had, but I don't remember the last time I felt this full. Do the Renans often not give you all enough to eat? It's never enough. The Renans decide exactly how much we'll have and when we'll have it. And that's that. We do our best to get around it. Everyone has to grow their own food and such behind the Renans' backs in order to get by. Thinking about it now, I wonder if they've always kept it meager so we would never have the energy to try to resist what they've done to us. Yeah. An empty stomach takes its toll on the body and the spirit after a while. How does a Renan like you know what it's like? I may be Renan, but they don't like me either. I could be squeaky clean and they still wouldn't give me anything. But, uh... <laughs> hmm. Did your stomach just... I didn't hear anything. But you just ate. How are you already... I said I didn't hear anything. 
I still have some I haven't eaten yet. Do you want it? Sure. Oh. I hate that I can see what's on the other side. I can't just walk in. <sighs> it's a defensive barrier. That's how it works. If we want to get through, we have to find the mechanism to lift it. Looks like this place used to be a supply base of some sort. It probably even dates back to the Great Conquest of three centuries ago. For an abandoned place, sure is crawling with critters. Kind of makes you wonder how they all got in. It's best not to let your guard down either way. Agreed. I don't know about you, but I'm not looking to hang around here any longer than necessary. Hmm. Ah. Uh-oh. New character change. Let's try her out. I won't forget oh, we can't. You. Oh, never mind. I wonder if it is where to play as her in game. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. Hmm. Actually, wait one second. Hmm. Okay. I won't forgive you. Looks like it could be worth something. Mm -mm. Ooh, what is this? Is this a chest of some sort? A Renin kind, yeah. We should definitely hold on to what's inside. I hear that. Investigation, you know. Right, here goes. Here I come. Go. Yes, come and face me. It's on. No escape. Huh? You picked the wrong One fight. More. Huh? 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 It's over. Huh? 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 Got fires. I've got this. Let a mark me handle it. Swallow blade. All yours. Here, here I come. You're finished. Burning strike. Huh? 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 Who wants to die yet? You're mine. It's over. Hey, for a mage, she's powerful. Great. Ooh. Nice. For a while now. Can we give up already? What, you're tired? I'm tired of something, all right. I'm not giving up until we search every inch of this place. She's really determined to find those clothes. Oh, wait, I feel like I can actually jump that, no? Am 
Nope. Okay, I'll be back. Oh, okay. We're back with... One more try, one more try. Oh, wait, actually... It was so much easier to get it from this side. I didn't think about that. Wait, what are you guys doing here? I need this. Oh. Recover, she learned. I feel like there's a way to like delay the combo almost. Well then, oh, let's keep moving. Chamomile. Okay, what new could herb. This be? That makes sense to me actually. Uh, what? There. Oh, okay, that works too. Okay, hold on. We're back. We're back. Let's see. Let's dispose of the trash. Ah, there is a delay. Okay, I knew it too. I delayed I delayed it after the fourth hit to kind of finalize. Like, I, I saw that I was missing the move swing like here and there, but I did see that it does actually matter what time you actually press buttons, etc. So that's cool. The real question now is where? Okay. Is there something over here now? Ooh, there is. Considering. No choice. Here I come. 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 to try and protect her in some way. We're form. in good form. Ooh. Okay. Turns out I had to come here. Hmm. Is this Renin technology? I'm amazed you guys can pull something like this off. For us. Sites like this are completely normal. Yes, yeah, sir. This must be the former owner's old wardrobe. Yeah. I wonder how long they've hung here. They don't look like they've aged a day. The designs are a little dated, but it'll have to do. Ooh. Listen, I get it. You care how you look. But we've got places to...
What is it? N no. I... Uh, nothing. We've kept Zephyr and the others waiting long enough. We should head back. Ooh. Huh? Okay. Let's head back to Ulzebeck. You're in a good mood. Were you that? You said before that this probably used to be a supply depot, right? That Nay thought it was a Renan castle. I wonder what it actually is. Who knows? Who knows? What, can't I not know something? You didn't think I knew every last thing about my own kind, did you? I didn't say that. <sighs> from what I've heard, a lot of the materials that were initially brought over from Rena 300 years ago were repurposed for other things over time. So it's entirely possible that this place used to be both a supply depot and a lord's castle at different points in time. They're not mutually exclusive. Mm. I couldn't tell you when the Lord's castle moved to its current location, though. Well, satisfied? Uh, it, yeah. Thank you. You know, for telling me about all that. Uh, it's not like I mentioned anything that useful. Come on, let's keep moving. Okay. You on. I just want to pick up the mushrooms, man. Behind you, Shion. Wait, I kind of want this. Thank you. I leave now. Okay. You want to get back to Ulzebek? Yeah, we better. We don't have time to waste. Someone's in a hurry. Ah. Oh. Cool. Oh, I like that. That's cool, actually. It's good to be back in familiar territory. Crap! Zephyr, we've got a huge problem. Mm -hmm. Something bigger than our attack on Balsaf's castle? Because I don't have time to worry about anything else right. Yes, bigger than that. The Bright Eyes. They've started massacring folks all over Caliglia. What? They must be after her master core. Guess the enemy must be getting serious about retrieving it. They must be if they're willing to kill the slaves they need to harvest astral energy. Moscow got hit real ha no bad. Way. What? Are you sure about that? Positive. It's the closest town to where we attacked them earlier. 
I feel bad for our people there, but them's the breaks. Damn it! Bastards. Just where do you think you're going? You know where. Mosul. What good is it going to do to... I don't need your permission. <sighs> hmm. Ooh. I'll take that. And then... I'll take that. Save my life, dude. Okay, that was crazy, actually. I need to be stronger. I can't believe I almost lost that. Like horrendously, actually. This does not seem. Uh, hmm. Okay. We gotta come back, but also. Also, I wanna change my skill. So, let's continue. I tried to actually get by you. I missed. Oh, 
Oh. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm pretty worn out. Oh, because she's on a uh, CP. Okay, gotcha. Hopefully that helps. Ooh. I'm almost inclined to think you guys are protecting something back here. I will be careful, though. So that parry though? Well then, let's keep moving. Ooh, a new okay, new recipe. We should try it and see how it turns out. Okay, new recipes and nice. See, I knew they were protecting something really good. I think it's worth a check. The counter dodges, the window is very hey, hang in there. Hey! Damn it. The counter window is very small. Gotta find residence. I'm too late. Stop! Please don't hurt the children. Oh, no. Damn it, I can't reach them in time. Get back, Cole. Duck. Cole, stop! Not if I can help it! Like, You're finished! I'm only getting started! Oh, Rising oh, water! By the oh, power oh, of water! You're finished! Die! Mega Ray! No escape! By the power oh, of water! Here I come! Oh, it's over! Oh, I'm only You're getting finished. started. You're mine. Here I go. You're finished. I'm only getting started. Swallow blade. Hear me. Fury. It's over. 
Are you all right? What about the others? Are those bastards still here? Iron Mask, take it easy. It's all right now. <laughs> Most were able to escape, and we've survived. Honestly, we got off lucky. It's often worse when a resistance group pops up. Lucky? You call people getting slaughtered like this lucky? This is how things go when you're a Danon slave. You're dead if you stand up to them. Keep your head down and do as you're told. At least then you have a chance to survive. You only have one life. That's why... I should wait for the right moment? Yes. So someone else dies instead while we live another day. Is that what you're saying, Doc? You're willing to risk everything on the chance that things will get better if we wait long enough. But what's the point of waiting if others have to die so that we can live? What do you think happens when someone tries to resist? It'd be one thing if the rebel died and that was that. But it never ends with only one death. You've seen it for yourself. Everyone suffers for it. Knowing that, are you really going to tell me our waiting has no meaning? But that's... I understand not wanting to throw away the same lives we're trying to protect. That would be senseless. But if you wait too long, if you get too used to waiting, then eventually you lose the will to fight. I don't want that to happen to me. I've already met the Crimson Crows. People who risk their lives to fight the Renan's rule. People who know they might not live to see us win, but fight anyway to give those who come after a better chance. If my life is at risk either way, then I'd rather spend it fighting. So you've decided to take up the sword? Yes, but not just any sword. It's a sword that only I can wield, but one that's also too powerful to use on my own. I doubt those who fought the Renans in the past ever had something like this on their side. That's why I'm willing to bet everything I have on this sword. I know it might mean more people end up in danger, but... Okay. If that's how you feel, then forget what I said. It's clear your time has come, Iron Mask. Currently, you and that sword are the only things capable of driving the Renans back. It's because of you that we're still alive right now. If there's a way through this for all of us, then I'll put my trust in you to find it. Doc... Thank you. Now, remember what you said. And don't ever abandon that conviction of yours, all right? Right. I won't. You've grown so much since we first met. And you've met some good people, too. Maybe you have a chance after all. Hmm. Doc is saved. Go back. The old back. Okay. Oh, in fairness, we can just fast travel there. We've reached our destination. You're back. Hurry on in. We've been waiting for you. You're not gonna ask what happened? I can tell enough by the way you look right now. I see. Zephyr, I need to ask you something. Would you have invited me to join you, even if I didn't have the Blazing Sword? Of course. Why, though? There are many folks out there who are crazy enough to resist the Renans like we do. So when I find someone with the knack for it, I make sure to keep them close. Plus, you remind me of another guy we lost. Maybe deep down, I'm trying to help you as a way of making amends for what I couldn't do for him. But if you don't want this, just say the word. I'm not going anywhere. If it weren't for you, I wouldn't even be here. If you say so. All right, come on in. Thanks.
Yes. Hey, Iron Mask. Can I have a minute of your time? What's wrong? Hey, Darren. What do you need? Well, all you've been doing since you got here is fight, right? I'm starting to get worried about how your weapon's holding up. After all, you're about to fight Balsef. You'll need to be prepared for whatever he might throw at you. Luckily, we have to have a blacksmith here on site. You should see what he's got tempered. Got it. All right. I'll make sure to remember that. Cool. Yes, please. Yeah, because we don't need to worry about the mantis. Where might you be? I have yet to visit the inn, so this will be... Ah! It's all coming together. I don't have anything interesting to sell you all, but you're more than welcome to take a look at what we got in stock. Cool! Uh... You know what? That's okay. Thank you. Hey. You the blacksmith here? Yeah! That one filled me in. In addition to farm tools, I also make weapons for the Crimson Crows. Knowing it's up, it's just for you, I just have to help. I'll forward you the best weapon I can manage with the materials I've got. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. That sword is really strong, but I need an astral crystal grain, which I don't have. So for now... This will have to do. Cool. And then she needs the same thing as well. All right. Noted. Ooh, look at that change. That's cool. <laughs> so, what do you think about this? Mm -hmm. Not bad at all. That's the most you'll get out of me right now. Bring me more materials, and I'll whoop you up something grander. Nice. This is plenty enough grand as it is. I never knew Zulu parts were so versatile. Good, good. Thanks. Glad to hear it. I'll leave the rest in your hands. Go give the Renner hell and set us free, okay? That's the plan. Ooh. Oh, you get a lot of skill points for the uh, quest as well. Is no this tier. something you're into? Yeah. Okay. These ingenious structures and gadgets never cease to amaze me. Check out these handle grooves. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be seeing here. Let's take an in moment as well. Thank you, thank you. All right, it is time to continue. You see anybody around here who could use our help? We can't chase after every little thing. Fair enough. All right, everyone. It's time. Remember, eyes on the prize. We're after Balsef. Nothing else. Cut off the head, and the snake perishes. Hit them head on, however. And we won't make it through the castle gates, but alone reach Balsef himself. Luckily, we have an ace up our sleeve. We need to do everything in our power to make sure that ace reaches Balsef's jugular. To that end, I'll be splitting us up into separate forces. You just said all of us hitting them head on would be useless. Why would we divide ourselves up? Because we're the decoys. We'll buy our ace in the hole the time they need to get in. We only need to cause enough of a ruckus around the castle to distract the enemy. That said, we need to look like the real deal, which is why I'll be tagging along too. You too, Zephyr? So, who's going to take on Balsef? The Iron Mask. I'm counting on you and Xion to make your way to wherever Balsef's hiding. Once there, you drive that flaming sword right through him. You aren't seriously sending in just those two, are you? One of them's a Renin. No one said the plan was perfect. By far, the biggest danger is the one you two will be facing. The fate of this quest rests entirely in your hands, which is why you get the final say. 
You want out? Now's the time to say so. And if we say no? Then you say no. Just means we're back to square one, that's all. And I go back to being a slave. It's your life. No, it isn't. Ball's in your court, soldier. What do you say? I... I want to fight. But for what? What are you fighting for? To free the Danans from the yoke of their abusive oppressors. To no longer die at the whim of another. To break the shackles of our enslavers. To live and taste freedom! Now you're talking. I believe we have our ace in the hole, people. Hold on to that belief, and we just might break through that wall yet. And what about you? I was born ready. Now can we get this show on the road? <laughs> There's a gate on your right once you leave here. Go through it and ride the elevator you'll find. I'll send ahead a few friendly faces to keep watch on your way. If you get into any trouble, look to them for support. We all clear? Good. May this battle herald the end of the Renan's bloody three-century reign. Dear battle stations, everyone. <sighs> I still can't believe this is happening. We're really about to face off against a Renan lord. Well... You're in pretty high spirits for a guy going into a life-and-death battle. I'm not saying I'm not worried. But you have to remember, this is the first time any of us Danans have really had any hope. What about you? Are you scared at all? I don't have time to be scared. This is only the first step in a long, long plan of mine. You want to take down all five lords, right? It's hard to believe it'll ever happen. But it will. I know. I haven't forgotten our deal. See that you don't. That said, if we lose, we might suffer a fate worse than death, you know. That's probably true. But instead of worrying about it, wouldn't it be a better use of our time to figure out ways to avoid that and not lose? I suppose. Whatever happens, I'll put everything I have into winning. You can count on that. So, we take the battle to Balseth very soon. So, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this. I'm actually in love with this game right now. It's incredible so far. I cannot wait to continue further. So, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Take care.